I and PK Gambly, the true master swordsman of Hyrule! I am the only blade master who has mastered every single sword technique! <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Oh, whoops, I just hit the bell. Oh, look at that, there's a heart piece. How delightful. And this is going to be another side quest part that I'm going to be going around the world collecting the stuff that I can collect as well as um, getting the prizes from Kinstone fusions and whatnot that I've left wandering around the world just collecting dusts while I was doing other stuff to make pro uh, progress. So that is what I am going to be doing this part, sort of like a uh, catch-up part of sorts, and I went too far up, didn't I? I want to go over to... well, I'll talk to this Minish. Um, maybe I should go hide in the Cuckoo Lady's house. It might be dangerous, though. It seems like there's danger everywhere. Hmm. There is a Cuckoo on the roof, though. That seems important. Let's go in. Uh-oh. I don't like the way they're looking at me. Oh, jeez! There's so many of them, and I don't, I don't really think there's anything to do around here aside from getting attacked by little cuckoo chicks. Yeah, these are actually dangerous to you, so be wary of them. <laughs> and they do home in on you like so. I'm just kind of messing around with them here. But yeah, I don't think there's really anything uh, that you can do in here besides go up the chimney, so let's go up. What? I can't throw fishes, flows, and disappear? What? Now that I can't get back to Andrew, I'm still happy! Uh, yeah, that's really all there's here, believe it or not. <laughs> it's probably my favorite room of the game, just because- Ah, no! Because of how frantic it can be with the chicks attacking you left and right. But it's, uh, it's a uh, pretty useless room as far as I can tell, because I don't think you can actually go through there via that hole anyway, it's just for that piece of dialogue as far as I can tell. Unless I f I'm missing something or I forgot something or something like that, I don't know, but anyway, I'm gonna go into this place next, which is the treasure box game, because we unlocked a new level to this, but we never even played the first level, so I'm gonna play through both levels. I guess there's no time for games, really, is it? We're playing a game right now! Oh wait, that's a fourth wall break. Never mind, F forget what I, that I said anything. Oh, no. Not customer. Why did I ever start a treasure game shop anyway? <sighs> Alright then. <clears throat> Welcome to a fascinating world of treasure. Blah, blah, blah. In this wonderland, you can test your luck and win big bucks. Maybe. I don't really recommend it myself, but... Whatever, it's your wallet. It's 10 rupees for one try. If you still want to throw your money money away on such a terrible pastime, I would really just save it if I were you. I'll give it a try. Oh, he falls over. <laughs> Level 1 is more than enough to take your money. <sighs> but if you're feeling particularly self-destructive, we've even got a level 2 now. Rue the day. Which level would you like to try? I'll start out with the easy. I see. Well, I guess I can't talk you out of it. Alright, I'll get it set up. Just going back after I do. Woo! And he goes on the train tracks. Alright, just open whichever chest you like. If you win, then I'll double the amount of your bet. It's a luck-based game, basically. Alright, yeah! Congratulations. Your prize is 20 rupees. I wouldn't recommend it, but you can wager your winnings and try again. Think about it. You already got a prize and everything. Don't push your luck. Let's do it! Ah, uh, I see. You did say it was my wallet after all. Well, when you're ready, just open another chest. And they reset. I'm gonna do the same one. Yeah! I'm on a roll, but I think I'm gonna stop here. <laughs> no thank you. My luck was with me today. I'm gonna show you how level two plays out. Woohoo! But I just wanna warn you, the wheel of fortune is ever turning. You may think you found easy money, but the life's not always like that. What I'm saying here is stay away, kid. Gambling's no good. It, it's kinda of funny, he runs a, a gambling business. 
but he seems to be greatly against gambling. I don't understand. <laughs> oh no. Yes. <laughs> Alright, level two. Let's do this. Uh, it's basically the same game, except they add a treasure chest, but you can triple your money. Let's see if I can win something out of it. Let's do this. No! Now see, see what happens when you gamble. Oh, uh, I tried to warn you. So, you're really done, right? And then he cheers happily that he's got my cash. <laughs> Sorry, no prize this time. That's alright, gambling's not what you thought it was, is it? And don't think maybe I'll win next time, either. Wake up, man. Get out of here before you lose the shirt off your back. Maybe he just has an issue with kids gambling or something like that. Like, maybe this is this is for, an, like, he's more okay with adults gambling than kids or something, and he's just trying to teach kids good planning and stuff like that. I don't know. Well, anyway, what I am going to do, that I do know what I'm going to do, is go around the world and collect some treasures. So, I'll see you around wherever I'm going, I suppose. Ooh. Okay, Mount Krennel. <laughs> There's a treasure chest that has been just plopped in this area for ages now. And uh, it's not around here. I mean, it's not, not like it's inside or anything like that. I just want to check for um, the Kinstone Fusion that I'm missing. I don't know where it is. It, it, I just expected it to be by that teacher, because that's where it typically is, and it wasn't. So I've been still puzzled as to where the Kinstone Fusion is. That's kind of an issue. <laughs> But I will get the remaining four kinstone fusions. Yeah, if you haven't been counting, I've got 96 kinstone fusions done at this point with only four remaining. Uh, anyway, the treasure is right. No. It is right here, and it's 200 mysterious shells, which reminds me I've also been um, spending a bunch of shells on uh, getting figures as well off camera. So, I'll be collecting those gradually as well. I'll probably collect even more uh, between this part and the next part. But anyway, I will see you at the next location. Now, the Wind Ruins here has been collecting quite a bit of uh, booty, so I'm gonna start here. And I'm sure you know the path around this place. And oh, yeah. Oh, I gotta be small. Gotta be small for that, so I gotta take this path once again, starting from here. Because uh, this, this is the only place that has a connected path to that particular area. And you just bounce around happily. Don't mind me, I'm just passing through here. There's a little hole over there, and I'm just gonna fall down. Alright, next location. Do, 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 do. Yep, gotta do this puzzle each and every time you come through here for whatever reason. I don't know why they did that, but it's kind of annoying. <laughs> anyway, Golden Octorok, let's go! You and I, no! Well, I, I guess I could use that, but still, no, you're getting in the way of my rhythm. <clears throat> no one gets in the way of my rhythm. For I am the Master Swordsman of Hyrule. And over here is the last prize in the area. A big bomb bag, and that is the final upgrade to your bomb bag. 99 bombs! Yes! Next location. Western Wood is the next spot that I'm going over to because, if you recall, very nice. And <laughs> first, if you recall, there was this very, very shy poet. And you said the exact same thing as I said before. I mean, as you said before. So, we're going to go inside now because I actually can do something here now that I have the lantern. Yeah, it's been a while since I've been here. I hope you remember it. <laughs> anyway, boop. Boop. Oh, jeez. Hey, you're friendly. 
Oh, dare you found me out. Don't tell anyone. And he gives me a prize, so I don't tell anyone. <laughs> and when you leave... Oddly, he somehow teleported inside. How does he keep teleporting places? How? I was just in here. It must have been the transition when it, the screen blacked out, well, whited out, whatever. Oh, my Link, thanks to you, I can finally go back to my house. It, it's... <clears throat> it's been totally rearranged, but I think it's a good look. I put my feelings of gratitude to verse. The way made safe, I came back home to find me inside all alone. In my chest, my poor heart aches, but for you, I feel the deepest thanks. Oh, just a moment. My dresser is entirely stuffed full of these icky blue sheet seashells. Would you clean them off for me? They're so smelly. Please? Burr, 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 burr. Yeah, I can use those. Oh my! Same thing, same, same thing. Okay. <laughs> oh wait, wait, is there anything else I'm missing here? No, I didn't think so. Okay, let's just go out. And... Aha! I didn't show that yet. <laughs> yeah, you can burn grass rapidly with your lantern like that. It's pretty handy. Uh, whoop. Now, where is the spot that I open up with a... I mean, which map time because I'm always lost ah this it's actually up no further north so it's over here oh geez and I haven't dug here yet because I simply just wasn't really through here and it's another green big wow 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 <laughs> that's a pretty good spot there all right so else can we go? Oh yeah! Royal Valley. That, kind of, that place is kind of annoying to get to though because it's, it's um, you can't warp there so it's just there to be there and I still haven't gotten all the pamphlets out of the post office that's why it's flashing. You know the swordsman newsletters. Mm, yeah I guess the Royal Valley is where I'm, go where I'm going next. Oh as long as I'm here I can demonstrate this to you. I still haven't showed you how fast the sword charges, did I? Oh yeah! Now that's a speedy charge. Oopsie. And here we are. The famous classic jingle. We have made it back to the graveyard. Hey, you weren't here before. Why are you here now? You shouldn't be here. Here is prize number one, a red kinstone piece. And prize number two is a red kinstone piece. Man, I'm just flooded with them now. <laughs> Look at that! Look at that! I think I overdid it with the green ones though, and I was kinstone grinding. Anyway, uh, next location, I guess. I have come to the conclusion that there's only one thing left for me to do, actually, before I go fuse the last element with my sword, and that is... Play the Kuko game. Yeah, you can actually get a heart piece out of this game. I was kind of misleading in how I worded it before. I said that you can't really get anything out of this, but you, what I really meant was you can't really get anything from this at the moment in time when I played the game because I didn't have the flippers and you need the flippers to win the last Kuko game. So let's start playing this game. The Kukos are always out, I swear. You just do not know how to keep them in check. <laughs> a really quick way oops, to get the Kukos in, in there is to throw them uh, in ahead of you and then roll after them. It's just a little bit faster than running normally. Oh, that pulse man, he's gonna get in the way, isn't he? Oh no, you don't. Okay, move on ahead, move on ahead, don't don't worry, I'm not going to hurt you. I just want just want to win the games. There's like nine versions of this game that you gotta go through, and I what did I go through? Like two of them? And none of the games are all that long to play. But it's a thing of uh uh, that you gotta play the, a lot of them, and I gotta show them all on camera. So let's catch five Kukos. The reason why I gotta show all of them is because they're all slightly different from each other, which is. Well, that worked. Haha! <laughs> 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 just, just 
throw the kukos right in the opening, everything will be just fine. And they give you ample amounts of time, as you can tell. Uh, there's sometimes a kuko, yeah, right here. Yeah, mm hmm keep moving, keep moving, go on. Oh no, that'll be my last kuko up there, no! Okay, it's gonna be my second kuko, suck in the last kuko. <laughs> Alright, golden kuko, no, 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 no. I don't have time for this. Ah. Like, literally, I don't have time for this. <laughs> oh, yeah! Last second PK Gam. And 20 mysterious shells and 130 rupees. See, those golden kukos do give you a bonus in the rupees. And once again, I'm going to be running out of space in my wallet. Isn't that delightful? <laughs> All right, more kukos. More kukos. Nope. Nope. Our button. Pick up, not roll. <laughs> All right. Only I could go on the roof easily and be able to get that one down. <laughs> Unless that one is just hers and she doesn't mind it being up there. Oh geez, they're really spaced out this time, aren't they? Oh wait, wait, wait! Ha! Ah. Okay, move along faster, faster. Go, 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 go! Ha! No! Bad, Kuko, bad. Oh, I'm gonna run out of time this time, aren't I? Boop. Maybe I'm better off throwing the golden ones ahead and leaving the uh, uh, regular white ones to do whatever. Yeah, I don't think. Oh geez. I wasted far too much time on this one. It's so easy to lose the Kukos. Arr. How many Kukos do you have, anyway? <laughs> Alright, so well, I know the locations of uh, those other ones, so I guess I'll start with the furthest ones first. There's one, two, three, and then there is... Let's... Hmm. Oh. What if I go like... What if I grab a Kuko? Oh, come on. Throw it ahead. Let it run. Throw another one ahead. Let it run. Like, sort of group them together, if you get what I'm trying to do here. I like to speed up the process of getting them. Oh, dang it. <laughs> well, it was, it was an idea to try, at least. Although I might still have a shot. I can get you back in five seconds. Two, one, zero, yeah! <laughs> yes! That was a little bit tight, but I was messing around there. Of course they've gotten out. They always get out. <laughs> oh, this one just appeared out of nowhere. So I was destined to grab it first. Actually, I don't believe in destiny, but... <laughs> But still, I just thought it would be funny to say. Oh jeez, why did I do that? That's the technique for golden kukos. No! I wasted too much time. Mm. Must get kuko reward. Must get heart piece of happiness. Must 100% game via chickens. Yes! Okay, the last one's gonna be the golden one, I guess. Mmm. This is always a pain, because it wants to jump out of your arms. Nope. Nope. Oh, yeah, I got it. <laughs> All right, how many more rounds do I have yet to go? Uh, how many more rounds do I have to go here? Whew, and my wallet's full again. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Six of them, jeez. In five, er, 50 seconds. They must be in uh, closer locations then because yeah they're all like around the same area because if they were at the same distance as they were before i would i would kind of question the feasibility of it dang it golden kuko you are always the worst <laughs> okay i think i'm just better off running the kukos in there it's just more consistent for me than trying to do some fancy speed running Tactics, you know, you know, like one at a time. I think that's how it was designed to be done anyway. Like based on their placement. Right. Uh oh. Uh oh. Go, 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 go. I don't think that's enough. I think I got five. I wasn't really counting there. Oh, I got them all. I mean, I got enough. Huh. Then I was like five seconds ahead of time. How many this time? Seven. 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 
seriously? Seven? <laughs> I'm gonna throw you ahead. Oh, and there's golden ones too. <laughs> Just trying to corral them into a row. Where'd the other one, like the other white one go? Oh, wait, no! Dang it! Jumped out of my possession. Oh, I went all the way to that corner. Yeah! It's supposed to end up at the wall. I mean, at the uh, fence, not the wall. Well, I suppose a fence is a wall, but not the kind of wall I was thinking. I mean, uh, the, it's a. Uh, ah, I'll forget it. <laughs> I've got Kukos on the brain. I'm going Kuko for Kukos. Arr! More Kuko. Ah, I'm not gonna have enough time this time, am I? Flub too much. Yeah. Alas. Alas, I must retry. This one's gonna be a tough one, actually. <laughs> I mean, seven in 60 seconds, that's a little bit tight. Oh, no, 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 no! I wonder if I should just restart. Can I restart? Well. Let's see if this works to restart it. Yeah, I think it did. <laughs> Makes this is gonna be faster than waiting uh, 45 seconds. Yep, it reset it. Round three. This time, it's extra personal. The feathers will fly. Oh boy. No. Because that, that, that's why I thought it would be... That's why I thought I would be able to reset it, is because she says, uh, don't go in buildings or leave town. Oh, that... I should have just went in the building then. To reset the game. Ah, that was a big waste of time then. I mean, a bigger waste of time than it needed to be. Right, I think... I think... This is the last. If I was counting correctly, I might have made a mistake counting... No, I made a mistake counting. Dang it! Mm. Yeah, this is not going to be in enough time, is it? Maybe I should... Start with the... Oh, jeez. There's a lot more Kukos over there than I thought. <laughs> Maybe I'll just go off on that area? Like, stick to the right side? Just need one more. Yes. Yes. What? Why do I keep miscounting? One more try. <laughs> Oh, seven. What? Oh, seven, not six. Why did I think... Uh, maybe it's because the last game was throwing me off or something. I don't know. Uh, no wonder I kept having my path be so inefficient because I kept miscounting. <laughs> Alright, Kuko. Nope. Wait, actually, I can leave you there. Let's not overthink the Kukos. Let's go... The furthest ones. Trail them off to that side by throwing them. That works. Okay. Yes, this is working well. Kind of. Okay, they're all in the corner. Yeah, I think this is the best method is to throw them. Dang it! Throw them ahead so that they wander over there themselves. Yep. That's a winning run right there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, about time. <sighs> 240, well, how many this time? Two of them, really? Okay, they must be really far away. <laughs> Let's see, is this the one that I need the flippers for? Maybe not. I'm just checking the outer... Oh, yep. Just what I thought. I mean that they... No, 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 no. But I mean that the furthest ones... I mean that they're very far this time. On my way back through here, I'm going to... Scout ahead for the other Kuko. Wherever the heck it is. <laughs> hmm. Well, I know that one's there. I know that it, they give me plenty of time to traverse the town. So that means there must be only two Kukos in the entire... 
in the entire town this time. Thank you, dog. So where is the last Kuko? It's gotta be really far away. Huh. <laughs> yeah, I'm a little bit puzzled. Like, I don't know where the other Kuko is. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, I know there's one at the upper left corner. So let's start out by going around the middle now. Just because I didn't before. Because, you know, the, the Kukos appear at roughly the same places that they did before. So, yeah. Huh. Nope. Bad dog. I can grab this one. Let's see, up, like, up here. No Kuko, really? Mailman is busy, he's having a good time. I'm just gonna look around while I'm holding this Kuko. Hmm. Is it in some grass? Maybe? Hmm. I'm a tad baffled. <laughs> I mean, I got that one for sure. Obviously, I can't go inside the chicken coop. Hmm, huh, well, you know what? Since I've seen this, um, I'm gonna go and do this between Kuko collecting portions or Kuko collecting sets. Um, if you notice, there was some lanterns to light over here. And... Boop. Boop. Well torches to light there. And this leads over to a red kinstone piece. Alright, more Kuko games. Interesting. Found that in the middle of the game. Oh, there it is. It's behind the buildings. And I'm not sure I'm going to have enough time to do this, but now I know its location. Alright. Rematch of the century. I'm going to start out by getting the furthest away Kuko, because I know that other one is much, much easier to get. So I'm just going to go around the perimeter like that, and thank goodness the dog was out of the way. The no! I, was, I thought I was going to uh, exit the town, that would have reset the game. Alright, so I can go through here? No, no, no bad people. Ah. And 20-some seconds for that other Kuko, really? That's a little bit tight. Roll, roll, roll. Okay, mm. go, 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 go. I can't roll on the way back. Because I will drop the chicken. Because it is also the throw button. Alright, three, two. Okay, I have plenty of time. But yeah, I see why they gave you so many uh, seconds for just two Kukos. There we go. <sighs> Still more. Three of them. Alright. Alright. <laughs> There's this golden one. I don't know if this is the most efficient route. I'm just going to... Ah going to grab it and go. Yeah. Mm. There's one. Mm. Are they all golden? Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> they just might be. Okay, that's two. Where could the last one be? Mm. Oh! This is the one you need the flippers for. So this is the last uh, challenge. Because you... I failed. <laughs> you gotta you gotta go across the river and throw it across because you can't go around because it wastes uh, too much time, basically. Alright, I know the routes. I know where the Kukos are. Let's do this. Let's start out with the hardest Kuko first. Right here. Oh, shoot. Can I, like... Throw it over the barriers. No, I, I didn't think so. Yes! You. This way. Come on. There we go. It's a little bit of Kuko corralling. Oh, no, not by the entrance. Eh. Restart. 
He won't even let me restart, really. Will this be the run? Find out at 11. <laughs> Alright, again, gonna grab the furthest away Kuko first. Because, well, I should say the most cumbersome Kuko first. Ah, just in case that happens. Let's do it. Go, 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 go. Link, go, Link, go, Link. Chicken, go that way. Saving as much time as possible. Arr. And... Yes, made it. No, bad golden cuckoo. Wait, actually that... Go across the bridge, that's very helpful actually. Just keep going along. No, bad. No. No. No, don't do that. Don't you dare do that. Okay, there we, there we go. It's two. Here's the third. Just gotta keep... The rhythm going, voila! Yes! <laughs> and I can't talk to you until the time runs out. Dang it! <laughs> so, nice weather we're having, huh? Just... And now... There's the reward! Finally! A piece a freaking heart! <laughs> yes! And you can keep playing the game, but you don't get any more pieces of heart from her. And with that, I think I'm gonna end off the part here because I am beat from all the chicken corralling. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part.